once again welcome my youtube channel nutri circle the students in this video i am going to be discuss about letter writing particularly formal letter how to write a formal letter in a proper way the students it is very necessary to know certain rules certain format while writing formal letter in this video i am going to discuss these rules and certain format how to write a letter in a proper way so just before that it is very necessary to note what what is formal letter and why should we write a formal letter the students if you look at there are certain reasons for formal letter writing special reasons are like that to take a leave to take make a complaint or information it is also called official letters because dear students if you see most of the government offices non government offices as well as semi government offices letter writing is very important whenever you want to make a communication you want to communicate to somebody else we can communicate while by writing a letter writing letter you can write a letter by hands manually as well as you can print it on paper it is very important it is a means of communication as a means of communication because you want to share your information to somebody else your authority your boss or etc send by mail or post in envelope like, that is very important dear students nowadays email writing become very popular but while writing a uh, email you should know the proper way proper rules of letter writing you can even post your letter you can back in envelope or send by post types of letters based on content it is very important there are different types categories of letters based on content there are some rules as i told very clearly these rules must be followed one by one margin your or sender's home address the date the recipient's address the salutation the body of letters word of thanks the closing and signature these rules must be followed the letters discuss this rules in detail if you look at the margin how much margin should be on paper leave one margin on the left side of your page so left side of your hand you should leave one inch margin sender's home address must be upper right hand corner each line of address exactly under the line above it the date is there below the sender's address on the upper right hand corner the recipient's address put on the left hand side two line below the level of the date and above the salutation another rule is the salutation one or two lines below the recipient's address close to the margin it is very close to the margin followed by comma after salutation for example if you write dear sir dear ma'am or dear patel or etc after that you should uh, keep the comma the body of letters there is background and the main points must be included in the body of letter word of thanks it is if you want to be express your gratitude you have to write a word of thanks write written at the left corner left or center of the letter usually ends with the letter thanking you that is very important because most of the time i often observe the students they write thank you it is not thank you it is an incorrect way of uh, that uh, writing a word of gratitude you should say thanking you the closing on the right hand side of the page you are faithfully dear sir if you don't know the person which you are going to write so you can write you are faithfully if you are familiar with the person you know the surname of that person you should write ever sincerely signature exactly under the closing write initials and surname initial must be there first and afterwards the surname if the signature is not uh, legible or it is quite difficult to understand so you should write your initial and surname there are some general instruction of formal letters you should keep in mind should not have friendly tone you cannot write a letter as you write to your friend or your close to you you should be serious because you are writing a letter to a responsible person or a serious person a person who don't have time to be read each and everything so it must be a serious one should sound business like it should be follow certain rules 
the universe should be clear and relevant there should not be a confused word or uh, those uh, words are difficult to understand words must be clear and relevant to your point skip unwanted details you should put necessary information unnecessary information should be avoided while formal letter writing as short as possible it should not be much lengthy it should not be one page or two page it must be just not more than two paragraphs you to find most of the letters not more than two or three paragraphs so it must be as short as possible these are some general instructions of formal letter writing uh, this is the format of uh, our sample of formal letter writing look at the sender's address here the uh, this is your below the center send us address there is a date you can write this address here also upper hand corner date b you can write there then address of the address in here subject you can include a salutation followed by comma body of the letters main point conclusion thanking you you are sincerely faithfully told you can say or uh, this rago rago that is what may call that the name of that person or you can write designation if applicable so such a things you can